Hotspot Shield service makes your internet browsing safer, more secure, and fully private. Click now to learn more. Welcome to my unboxing and overview of an extremely exciting product. This is the WD Black Squared Dual Drive, which is to say that when you open up the package, there is two drives inside. And I'll show you guys this. Check this out. We got, uh, we got inside. Okay, well, there's a USB drive. And then if you dig under the quick install guide, which is in about one bajillion languages, and the technical support and limited warranty, which is a five-year warranty because this is a Black Series dual drive, you find another drive. So there it is, a USB drive and a hard drive, the black square. No, that's not what it is at all. Okay, I'm sorry, you guys. This is just the software that you need to take advantage of Western Digital's first consumer grade hybrid drive. But when they call it a dual drive, it's a little bit different from the kinds of hybrids that we're normally used to. This is a nine and a half millimeter form factor. So double check your notebook to make sure it works. It doesn't go down to seven millimeter like many SSDs and even high capacity hard drives do these days. But there's a reason for that. It has both a one terabyte 5400 RPM notebook drive inside and a 120 gig SSD. Okay, Linus, but this isn't the first time we've seen a hard drive and an SSD jammed into a two and a half inch enclosure. The first time we saw it was actually about three years ago with the Seagate Momentus XT. So this is basically the same, right? The answer is no. The Momentus XT uses a regular notebook hard drive, just like this one does, and it uses a four gig for the original or eight gig SSD as a cache. So that is to say that you never actually see it. It's working in the background, accelerating applications, bringing that hard drive's performance closer to SSD, but not quite to the same level as an SSD. The Black Squared uses a very different implementation. So it actually takes a dedicated 120 gig SSD and lets you throw your operating system and your key games and applications on it for lightning fast, pure SSD performance, which isn't to say that it's the fastest SSD on the market or anything like that, but it is light years faster than a mechanical hard drive, especially if you're coming from a hard drive, you go to SSD, you're like, whoa, holy crap, they're fast. Anyway, so it's an actual dedicated SSD. Then it has a completely separate one terabyte hard drive that you can use as a dedicated storage drive. So it actually shows up to your system as a C and D drive that you will manage separately. And there's a little application that you install off this clever USB USB drive in order to get all of that working. So, okay, Linus, I don't know if that's the kind of thing that my mom would find as user friendly as this drive where you just plug in the one drive and it shows up as one drive and it's all works in the background. And I think WD knows that because look at the branding on it. It's black. It's intended for enthusiasts. It's intended for the folks who are able to see the value of having two specialized solutions installed in their computer within one enclosure that are each good for a different thing. So that is the SSD for small storage, but fast, and the hard drive for large storage, but not nearly as fast. And who is it actually for among the enthusiasts? Well, I would say the notebook guys. Someone who has a notebook that only has a single two and a half inch bay, please bear in mind guys, it is a nine and a half millimeter drive. So you're not gonna be installing this in every single notebook out there. Double check with your manufacturer for compatibility. But if you have a single two and a half inch bay and you want the best of both worlds without having to deal with carrying around additional external drives. That, my friends, is who this is for. Thank you for checking out this unboxing and overview of the WD Black Squared Dual Drive. Now we understand the name of it. Don't forget to subscribe to Linus Tech Tips for more unboxings, reviews, and other computer videos. It's been a while since we've done this, but uh, yeah, I forgot something. There's also a USB transfer cable included. So that's USB 3, which is handy, nice and fast. And it's also included in the quick start guide how to back up your old system to your new black squared drive and be pretty much ready to rock pretty quickly there. So there you go, SATA in there and then USB 3 there. And I love this auxiliary power right there.